Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got the Tudoresque collection from A. England and it was inspired by King Henry VIII and his six wives. We're going to start with Sir Loyal Heart, the name used by King Henry VIII when jousting, one of his favorite entertainments. It was a, it's a plum toned dark brown velvety hollow with gold shimmer flicks and it is just gorgeous and it really could be a one coater beautiful. <clears throat> Next we have Catherine of Aragon. She was the first wife and the daughter of the King and Queen of Spain. Her marriage lasted 23 years and then it was an old. Um, it, this one's a gray sand velvety hollow with gold shimmer flakies. Next we have Anne Boylan. Um, she was the second wife and the mother of the future Queen Elizabeth I the key figure in the political religious change in England from Catholic to Protestant. Her marriage lasted two years and she was beheaded for treason. It's a rich velvety hollow with light pink inner glow. This is a beautiful polish. <clears throat> Excuse me. And next we have Jane Seymour and she was the third wife. She was subdued and peaceful and she was from lower birth and raised in the country where Henry would go hunting. She gave birth to a son and died of postnatal complications, and her marriage lasted one year and four months. It's an under-saturated, dark, mossy green, velvety hollow with gold shimmer flakies. I really thought this one was unusual and quite pretty. I loved it. Next, we have Anne of Cleves. Anne of Cleves was the fourth wife. She was a German princess, a wise woman, and she was disliked by the king at first sight, but proceeded to marry her. The marriage lasted six months and was annulled for not being consummated. You know, given a really generous settlement by the king. It's a pale pink with a velvety hollow. Slight glow. Oh, love it. Catherine Howard is next. She was the fifth wife. The marriage lasted one year and three months. She was beheaded at 21 years old for alleged adultery. Um, this one is a teal velvety hollow with gold shimmer flakies, and it's just, they're just all so rich and gorgeous. Mm. And last, well not last, nope, the last of the wives is Catherine Parr. She was the sixth wife. Um, she was a far cousin of the king, twice divorced. Um, she restored the unity at court between the king and his children. She survived him. The wedding lasted after three years and six months. Um, this one's an indigo blue velvety hollow. It's gorgeous. And the most happy. Anne Boylan chose this for her coronation. And it sounds appropriate to all the wives at the time they were chosen. It's a royal purple velvety hollow with a slight pink inner glow. And it's just crazy pretty. I loved all of these. I really did. They were just gorgeous. So here we go. We're going to show these now with their second coat and a glossy top coat on top. We're going to start here with the first one, which is Sir, Sir Loyal Heart. And then next we have Catherine of Aragon. And this deep, oh, Anne Boylan. This is just such a deep color. I love it. And then Jane Seymour. And then next, this light pink one is Anne of Cleves. And then this teal blue one is Catherine Howard. And the next blue is Catherine Parr. It's so bright and electric looking. Mm. And then finally, Most Happy. So I hope you enjoyed my swatches. Please leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think of this collection. That is all I have for today. I want to thank you for watching. And until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.